Hello friends. Today we will see how to recover a fish which is suffering from this kind of skin shred, so don't forget to like and subscribe. Let's get started. First, remove the infected fish from aquarium as other fish will harm her more with eating her skin making her more hard to heal. For that you require a bucket with a air pump, look I've attached air pump so fish could breath easily. Second, now you need 2 tablespoon of rock salt or selenomac plus anti-chlorine medicine 6 tablespoon, plus anti-itch blue 1, for stopping the fungus. Now fill the bucket 10% with old water for bacteria. Now check the temperature of water in aquarium, as it is 30 degrees approximately so we need to fill bucket with fresh water with same amount of temperature. Here's a tip. Use your hand to dip in both aquarium and bucket simultaneously, to get the rough idea of water temperature. As you can see water is on 30 degrees Celsius in bucket which is perfectly fine so now it's time to add meds. Add 2 spoon rock salt. Now add 6 spoons anti-chlorine. And at last 4 spoons anti-itch medicine. Now put the fish in bucket for 1 day. Make sure to have stable air connection. At last cover the top of bucket with clips and chuni. As fish could jump out at night and you never want that. Now let's uncover the fish next day. Dot. I give her few pinches of food but she doesn't seems to be enough conscious to see it, so let them float in water. Be sure to change some amount of water and add anti-chlorine as the water becomes cloudy or dirty. I've placed a water heater too as this is cold season and water becomes too cold which is deadly for our fish. Next day we will add medicine named CIPMOX500, available in any chemist shop, this will speed the healing 10 times faster, you can also replace anti-itch medicine with this capsule. I'm adding 2 to 3 tablets as my fish is big and have a massive trauma, not put more than 4 capsule at a time. You can feed a very little one time a day in between if your fish is eating, it is important not to give more than one pinch of food as it could spoil your medicated water. And now let's cover her again. Now let's make your fish to stay in her ICU for 3 to 4 days until she recovers fully. After 9 days my fish recovers fully. Time of recovery depends on care and the amount of infection in the fish. Share your recovery experience in comment section and do like and subscribe for more videos. Be free to drop ideas below. A peace.